let's just can we can we I like really appreciate the high ponytail can we can we see that can we hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel as you can see I'm back with another video and it's basically a high ponytail with the back what is this called it's called a half up half down quick weave ponytail but I love this hairstyle as you can see Hello everyone, so we're just going to start off by parting our hair dead in a center horizontally. Uh, you want it to be more focused towards the top of your hair because we are executing a high ponytail. Okay guys, so now that we have uh, parted our ways through our hair, we just want to section it off and we are going to braid the back of our hair, which will be the quick weave part in two braids. It doesn't have to be anything special because we're going to put a wig cap on that is coming up in this upcoming. All right, and right here I'm just showing you guys the limit of how far we're going to have the tracks going up in the back. Uh, right, right here is a little bit self-explanatory. We are going to be using the hair glue, putting it on the tracks, lining the tracks up to where I showed you the lining in the last clip. And it's basically going to be lined up like an invisible part going um, vertically. Alright guys, so right here we're just cutting that wig cap down and that's where our high ponytail is going to go. You just want to make sure that you cut all of that wig cap off like so and everything should be good. I do have to add a couple more tracks at the top and cover a little bit on the side but everything is definitely just self-explanatory right here as well. Okay, so this is an important part. You want to make sure that the top of your hair is as flat as possible. As you can see, I am just doing a run through with the chasing comb method, going through my hair one time, making sure I get those baby hairs and everything around the perimeter. We want a clean, sleek, silky look when it comes to our high ponytail. We don't want it to be wavy or bushy. We want it to be as straight as possible. Um, if you are natural, I will look into getting curly hair just to match the texture of your hair as well so i'm just going to let you guys listen to some music as i continue my straightening All right, because this is a half up, half down, two strand ponytail hairstyle, we are going to section off our two strands and later on we will add a couple more tracks just for added smoothness. All right, so I do have to add a little bit of blow drying to my edges because my hair is so curly and so natural that if I put anything on my edges, I have to immediately put the blow dryer on just to freeze that into a place. I don't want anything to be curly, especially my edges. So here I'm 
showing you guys the wax stick that I purchased off of Amazon. Link will be in the description box. At first, I thought it was turning my hair white, but as it goes on and as you rub it and brush it in, it uh, dissolves within your hair. And it does actually work. Is it worth it? I think that you can go definitely uh, without it if your hair is straight enough, for sure. Centering or high ponytail, you just want to braid that ponytail down. In the upcoming clip, you're going to see that I use the uh, papers just to protect the hair from the hair glue. So just braid that down. If you need to add a little bit of weave to your hair for thickness or fullness, you can do that as well. the juicy part right here is where I had to learn my lesson as you can see the crop video I did not put the rubber bands on my head which made my ponytail not stand up how I wanted to you want to make sure that you put those rubber bands and stack and layer them because that's where the volume of the high ponytail is going to come right now this is the paper that I mentioned in the previous clip of the protection from the hair glue you just want to wrap that around and at the end like as you can see, you want to add a little bit of hair glue to it and then wrap it around one more time. Take the blow dryer and secure that just so that will not uh, move at all. Now you're going to take the end of the uh, track and make sure you hold that one with the hair glue and blow dry it. A little technique that I have came up with is you want to put the glue on first. As you can see, I am using the double track method and just wrap the tracks around. And as you wrap the tracks around, make sure you're taking that blow dryer just to secure that everything will stay because the last thing that you want is for your ponytail to literally fall off when you're walking down the street. So make sure you secure with the blow dryer like so and everything will be good. Alright, so with this part, you want to take a piece from the back, and that's going to be the wraparound piece. You just want to uh, spray a little bit of your choice of hairspray or holding spray. I'm using the big head spray. Spray it on first. Make sure you comb the piece out. Wrap it around. Spray a little bit more on, and then secure that with blow dry. You want to repeat that process. So you uh, comb the piece out, spray it. Wrap it, spray it again, blow dry it. That's how you get it to be, you know, secure and for it to stay and to not move whatsoever.
So if you have thicker hair, you don't have to worry about this process, but I do like my hair to be a little fuller in the front, so I'm adding about two tracks on each side. Um, it adds a little bit of fullness, and I just love full hair. My hair is very thin, so it works for me. Alright, so this is the finished product before styling. I just wanted you to, guys to see it in its raw form. As you can see, I had a little white stuff in my center part, but I'm going to insert a little clip of what it looked like curled. I mean, I did have that in the beginning, but just as a little closer, I wanted you guys to see. I also did add extra tracks to the back after this video. It was tough trying to record and add the tracks, but just know I did add these tracks in my final part. Thank you so much. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.